Good Kitten Internet. Uh, once more, I am Aether Spoon, and joining me via live chat is my partner, Creator. Hello. And we're heading back into Alpha Centauri. At least this time, it's been less time since the last time that we did this. I don't remember what happened last time. I don't entirely remember myself, but I do remember that we have discovered another faction. It also helps mm -hmm. that both of us saw not the previous video, but the one before that recently. Um, yeah. You recently watched it, and I recently edited it, so. Turn complete. Okay. Um, yeah, there's definitely Chowdon over here. Concentrated oh, yeah. in this little area with a little bit spread out. There's Mount Planet. Mm -hmm. I think that was even one of the spots that I had highlighted going, that could be Mount Planet. I don't remember. I would have to go way back and oh, yeah. have a look. Um, Fossil Field Ridge, which is the worst of the natural wonders, other than yeah. the dunes. Because they only ever appear in deep water. Mm-hmm. And if you terraform up, you lose it. Yes. Um, the exception would be if you are pirates. Right, because they get extra bonuses. They also gain the ability okay. to terraform deep water. Yeah, that. But that's still pretty far down the tech tree, and it's still kind of useless. I just think of it like a pretty natural yeah. wonder that shouldn't be exploited. I would agree. Although my last game, I accidentally eliminated the entire fossil fuel ridge. Accidentally? What, with a tectonic missile? Uh, no, I was raising terrain, but not at the coastline. I didn't realize that I was also raising coastline terrain. Ah. Uh, yeah, it looks really ugly if you destroy part of it. Yes. Yes, it does. The game is not meant to handle that. Um, looks like this is where the um, jungle is. Monsoon jungle. Yep. There's a little tiny bit on this island as well. Uh, that I that part that tiny island does not have any. Okay. Uh, what else do we have? We still don't know anything about the data jacks other than the fact that their capital's here. And uh, same thing with the free drones. Hmm? Check the com link to make sure we're up to date on. Yeah, we haven't okay. met them. Yeah, but we're at the Neto with Chaldon. That's the part Correct. that I was wondering about. Um, the pirates exist. But you only have a truce. I yep. seem to remember you asking for a treaty and them saying no. Yes. Um, that was actually in the last video that went up. Um, so for reference, today is the 8th of January, for those that might be wondering how far back we're recording these. Uh <clears throat> This would probably be up the 18th, roughly. Uh, looks like we're researching synthetic fossil fuels, so we're starting to approach air power. Um, we still don't have a map worth a darn, other than our own. I'm assuming that we ended up trading or stealing Chadon's world map. Actually, probably stealing. Mm -hmm. And yeah, um, we are running wealth now, which is the reason why the pirates are really going to hate us soon. Wealth green. Yes, wealth ah. green. Well, it's not like we can run knowledge, and running planned right now doesn't do us any good. We're pretty close to maximum population in a lot of places, I think. Well, these three aren't. We probably could run yeah. planned again now that we have more bases, but no particular reason to run it right now. Uh, Maritime Control Center is currently in production. I could switch it over to the Empath Guild so I can contact the others, I guess. Project initiated. Maybe I should, actually. 
But then right. they will all have each other's uh, comlinks and can convene the UN Council, and you're not invited to that. This is true. I would not get the Empath Guild when you can get any other wonder. Yeah, that's fair. Um, we are having some eco damage issues, but that's hardly surprising. It's at the point of the game where I would expect us to have eco damage issues. Um, Conqueror Bar is still winning. Your kitty is still a... saying hi. She's on my lap and purring and trying to find that treat that went flying <laughs> right before <laughs> we started recording. And there's so much crap on my desk. I have been working on clearing off some of the crap on my desk. I can actually see desk at this point. Yeah. And like she will not relent. Um, no, I'm not going to give you money to end this. Okay. And Mar, of course, isn't going to talk to a fellow progenitor, so let's go ahead and go to the next turn. Oh, fun. Hmm. This is where it would be nice if you still had the Unity Chopper. You did lose that, right? Um, I don't think I actually did. No, it's right there. You still have it. It's just far away, so I can't yeah. reach it this turn. Yeah, fuel is six. Um... Yeah, that's because it's air to air. Yes. Whose bright idea was it to bank the Unity Chopper air to air? That um, makes no sense for a Scout Chopper. I'm pretty sure it's specifically to make it weaker. Yeah. Well. No, I'm just going to have it move to Consonance, which it's going to take a couple of turns to get there. This is concerning as well, but I don't have any units nearby, right? And right. it's going to have to cross a square of non-fungus. Yep. Before it so can get in. So I do have a little top. bit of time. Um, flat, rainy, twelve hundred. I need to finish that video that I started on um, terraforming and terrain in Smack. I had started making a PowerPoint presentation on how this works because it is very confusing to not just Candace who is watching, but also other people. It's not easy to tell when you're not used to it. Yeah, I still have things to learn about terraforming, probably. Mm -hmm. I, like, do I don't even. understand how they calculate how long each action takes. Mm hmm. I mean, there's the weather paradigm, there's superformers. Yep. But does the type of terrain matter? Yes. Um, both rocky and fungus add an extra turn to ter terraforming. I or an extra... Was hmm? that mine? No. Yes. I was about to say, I don't think that was on my side. Ah, okay. Um, let's see... I don't think I meant to put the colony pod I mean, there, given that there's nothing else there. Need to pause for a moment? Status. I'm just going to set my status to busy, or do not disturb. Okay. How do I do that on mobile? There. Do not disturb. Okay. Um, looks like this unit is just scouting... You yep. have built a sea base. That base is not going to prosper. No, no, it's not. Especially once a faction claims the land. Fungus, 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 fungus. Yeah, this isn't going to go well. Uh, do the planet cult have fungus bonuses like the Gaians do? Um, I don't think they do. Let's find out. Faction profiles. 
Cult of Planet. Nope. Yeah, the Cult of Planet... Well, they'll have bonuses by virtue of having increased planet rating, but not... That's more lack of penalties rather than bonuses. They don't mm -hmm. have, like, the Ga Gaians are one free resource, was it? It's plus one food and fungus. Ah, uh, it's just food. Okay. The fun fact, the negative resources aren't negative food, it's negative everything. Huh. Okay, this is a nutrient spot. Just gonna root it for the time being. I believe all we're doing in here is wow, they have a lot more formers than I'm used to having AI with. Uh, can you ever hold that no, spot? No. Didn't think so, but. Um, let's just wrote it for now. Okay, I seem to remember that this colony pod was going to be going down here. It's just that there's so much fungus nearby that I needed an escort. Yeah. This is being converted to solar panel. Technically, this area is still un undiscovered. Yeah, you, turn, you turn off fog of war to where you yep. see where you haven't been. Yep, I remember doing that last time because it was obnoxious before. I putting the space. I would really prefer to not have to have yet another base without or that's waiting for a former to come by and fix up the tile that it's on. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I see you have a sleeping colony Paul that future yep. base. And this is the unit that's going to be going that way. I remember that from last time. I swear the beginning parts of these videos are me just trying to remember what in the world I was doing before. Oh, you servers have a pretty beefy graph there, and we're actually below the pirates. Yep. We're below the pirates because the pirates can easily expand. Yeah. So they probably have more bases than we do, which is why I'm so concerned about them being this close. You don't have infiltration for, on them. Nope. Um, it's because I don't have any sea colonies on this side of the continent. Or um, coastal colonies. Yeah. I mean, I could probably make an amphibia. Do I even have the tech for amphibious? Yes, I do. So I could theoretically make an amphibious probe team. I, I don't think probe teams can have amphibious, can they? I don't know. Let's find out. I know they can't have air superiority. Right. Nope. They can't have amphibious either. Exactly. So, yeah. Um, that means that I can't really infiltrate them right now. Unless I you get the probe ship. Right. And I think there. that this base that I'm going to be producing is going to be coastal. Yeah, it's going to have to be if you don't want to overlap. Right. Well, I could slide it down a little bit to here. Yeah... But, eh, I'd rather have it be coastal. I need a coastal base on that side anyway. Yes, you do. Production or complete. we do. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um... And I remember you're not building hab complexes because then you'd start yes. having your own problems. Yep. That's hardly surprising for me, though. Production complete. Me with drone problems? That's impossible. Terraform complete. 
to sleep for a while. You are mm -hmm. continuing that way. Okay, good. There is coastline that is not fungus. That's what I was hoping for. Condenser. Ah, you're following me. Of course, this it's hungry. Okay, I have my first sea former. That's nice. So, since I haven't actually, ooh. That mindworm can actually attack the chopper. Mm. I didn't think because about that. Uh, because choppers count as land units whenever they're stopped. Mm. Or not really land units, floating units. Um, land units can attack choppers that have stopped. And so can sea units. So... In regular smack, they pretty much never actually do it, but they're technically capable of it. Well, it'll be interesting to see if it happens. Yep, and if it happens, oh well. Then you won't have to pay up keep for that chopper anymore. Indeed. Indigenous no. No. I really wish I could rotate the map so I can yeah. see like what in the world is going on on the square. I mean, I can see it down here, but it makes it hard for me to know, okay, am I bordering a mirror or anything? I think the intent would be to throw a mirror there. So if that's the case, then I should actually solar that. Let's zoom back out. Yay, scroll wheel zoom is working. Yeah, scroll wheel movement is terrible. Yes, it is. Aki! Hi. Hello again! <laughs> it's been a while. Yeah. Ah, your might is pathetic. I see not much has changed. Um, no, I'm. My earlier arrogance was entirely valid. Oh no, they're advanced recon rover prototypes. I don't know if I can handle this. But you know what? I'm actually okay with the blood truce. Yeah. I have no intention of actually attacking Aki, at least not right now. She's too far away anyway. And a treaty is acceptable as well. Actually, I wanted to talk with you and get a map. Uh, no, I'm not giving you deflexibility unless if you give me something better. And watch while your horrific minions twist the fruits of my labor into instruments of vile treachery! I think you overestimate my gullibility, my dear guardian. Damn it, I just want your map. Okay, you don't have any comm links for anybody else. So, Aki is on this continent. That's not Aki's color, though. Is that the drones? Yeah, but they're really far away. The drones are all the way up here. Then who is it? That's a good question. Indigenous life form. I'd like to take that. Thank you. Wow, they're really crammed in there, the pirates. Maybe I should have tweaked the settings a little bit to, um... Whatchamacallit? Uh... Make it where they don't build bases quite as close together? 
I wonder if that actually it. is Aki, and it's just that it's glitching the color. Maybe. Production complete. Although if she's sharing a continent, that would explain why her might is feeble. This is true. <sighs> Poor Aki. That means that she started on a continent shared with somebody and then respawned on a continent shared with somebody. Mm-hmm. I mean, that is the continent that I thought that the um, usurpers would be on, but... Okay. You um... have cruisers, so maybe make a, a cruiser, or it is that much, much more expensive. It is a lot more on. expensive, but that might not be the worst idea. Um... The extra yeah. movement is nice. Food. It's time to start getting even more formers. Although, actually, maybe you should just have a military unit. We'll go with the Mindworm. Uh, you're spending a lot of minerals on upkeep, so maybe you should build some probe garrisons. Yeah, it's probably time to actually at least prototype a probe garrison. Okay. Uh, why plasma steel when you have three res? Because it costs more. Oh, okay. Three res costs 45, plasma steel costs 36. That's actually the downside with both three res and pulse three. Is that they cost more. But three res would also help against um, native life forms a bit better. Yeah. And if you make it trans in addition to that? Which is free, even though it doesn't look like it should be. Yep. Trans 3 res is the same price as trans plasma steel. Hmm. There's a lot of weird math that goes on when it comes to this. Maybe I should have yeah. a video explaining that at some point. Even though I don't... Like, I didn't even realize that these would be equivalent up until... Would have been my first thinker game, I think. I wonder if it's a thinker change. Okay. If, are you currently researching neural grafting? No, I'm currently researching um, synthetic fossil fuels. We yeah, are right. Yeah, the destroyer probe team costs 63. The foil probe team costs 45. That is a significant difference. Yeah. But I'm still going to prototype it. It's not going to hurt to have the prototype. And honestly, it's an extra two turns. I think it's worth it. Okay. Which of these bases actually has an extra garrison? Just My Starheart. Mine didn't attack Chopper. Nope. Which is good. The Chopper lives to see another day. Again. I'm actually going to move you closer because I don't trust that mind from sitting there. Oops. <laughs> Apologies. Um, let's see. All right. Where would I want to put this? So, unless if I were to put it there, which is a fungal spot, so I can't. I can't get both of these mineral resources, so I'm only going to get this one mineral resource. There's a chance that there's another one over here, but... Uh, I'm move like that. Okay, that gives me a better picture. Honestly, that spot might not be the worst... That spot would be slightly better because there would be more land. I have to assume mm -hmm. that I'm not getting any of the ocean tiles. Yeah. You can build supply crawlers now, so it's not that critical to have the right. mineral resource in base radius. Yep, I would agree. Ooh. -hoo. Aha. We're going to monitor you. Uh, 
And I know this child only is leading in wealth. He must have a mindworm based economy. Probably. Capturing even more Isles of the Deep. Excellent. This Isle of the Deep is going to go around. Mm hmm. Okay. So. When it comes to terraforming in ocean tiles, um, ocean tiles are not very good compared to land tiles. You can only, in general, you can only get either minerals or um, energy from them. And just like on land, where if you mine on top of a farm that the farm nutrients go down by one, the same thing happens in the water. So really water tiles are mostly useful for food and energy so whenever yeah, I, I do I these do. I just do food and energy until fungus is better yeah I tend not to build sea mines a whole lot and on land I only build mines in rocky terrain mm -hmm. where I can't farm anyway or forest sleep uh, we are going toward the coast. I haven't decided exactly where. Ideally, would be here, but once more fungus. Uh, maybe I should have yeah. been a little more aggressive in having more formers. Uh, do you have the tech for clean reactor yet? No. Terraform complete. I know that I don't. All right. How much does it cost to buy you? Request confirmation. 85? That's cheap. It's mine now. I don't even care that I lost the probe team. And you are getting updated to Trans 3 Res Sentinels because it's in a war zone. I definitely mm -hmm. want that lockdown, so to speak. Well, that explains why they expanded in the direction that they did. All of this is deep water. Their poor capital. Their capital is garbage. It's useful for food, and that's it. complete. Alright. Um, I think I was actually going to be putting the unit there. Yeah. That's what my memory is telling me. Big, yeah. Um, and the energy resource. Mm -hmm. I mean, and once that you get thing... rid of that fungal power, you have a river. Right. Yep. Oh, so speaking of things that I didn't know about complete. terraforming before, did you know that if you put a borehole on a river, the river disappears? Huh. No. So, like, if there was a borehole here, for an example, the other half... Oh, wait a second. This river doesn't have a terminus. Huh. Like, it goes from here to here. Okay, so this is a bad example. Let's use a river that has a good example. This one here. Where the terminus uh -huh. is here, and it starts here. If you were to put a borehole here which I think one of these two would actually be a valid borehole spot. The river will go from the high point to the borehole, and that's it. Makes sense. It does. It's just not anything I had ever thought of. Severe Haze in Home Hearth. Oh, that's going to be annoying. That's actually one of my better bases. Fossil fuels in the last century reached their extreme prices because of their inherent utility. They pack a great deal of potential energy into an extremely efficient package. If we can but sidestep the 100 million year production process, we can corner this market once again. CEO Waburuke Morgan, strategy session. Oh, Morgan. I mean, he's right in one way that synthetic fossil fuels would basically be a better battery. Okay. 
air power or environmental economics. I know why are both options at once. So to explain, um, environmental economics has tree farms. Since I am heavily into forests, tree farms would add an extra food and an extra um, energy in every square that I have a forest in once I build the tree farm in that city. Yes, one more food, no extra energy, because forest already has energy. Forest has one energy by default. It goes yeah. up to two, two, two from one, two, one. It's hybrid forest that is only plus one food. Huh. Um, the other option is air power because flying. And I am at war with multiple factions, and I'm going to be at war with multiple factions yeah. for a good chunk of time. And um, I might actually be in range of using air base, well, especially now that I have a base sitting in the middle of Cha Don's mm -hmm. bases. So I think we'd actually go for air power. The extra food from tree farms would help you grow, but you don't want yeah, to grow all that much right now. That is a good point. Oh, that makes me feel bad. But yeah, I think that does make the most sense. They are both lovely techs. Yes, they are. I think I'm going to build my base there. I need to hurry up and actually build some bases. This is getting ridiculous. I don't have that many for me. And that's fine. I am glad that I built the set of defaults that I have, although, actually... Oh, wait, no. I only have it set for a Trans Scout Patrol right now. Um, I was going to say, perhaps I should actually have a... Um, probe yeah, Probe Garrison as a part of it. Probe team I'm not as concerned about right now because I'm not sharing a continent with anybody. Eventually, I'm going to need probe garrison in my coastal cities. You're going to sleep to heal. You should send someone out to deal with that fine worm. Yep. They are... At the very least, that unit can do something about it. Yeah. Even like if it's... Disrupted zone of control. Right. Making sure that it doesn't go after things that I want to keep standing, like forests inside of Home Hearth's territory. Which, speaking of... Yeah. Okay, yeah, you're okay for right now. Nope. We're not doing that today. Money, sure. At so, least it's not a solar problem. Yes. <laughs> um, so this transport is going to be going after all of the pods, so I can actually get some alien artifacts, or, excuse me, library artifacts. Library nodule. Yes. Artifact. Crap. Well, that sucks. You know what? Bot recovered. I get less money, but I don't get the stupid. I think that's worth it. You should maybe move that mine worm over to that. Fungus cluster. Yeah, that's yeah. a good idea. Well, it'll start heading that way. After it's this rested. mind worm, on the other hand, is closer. Who will also start heading that way. Good thing I have a lot of mind worms in this area. Okay. You're going to hold. I no longer see the unit. So I'm going to move that mind worm because down. To... Sensors. I haven't even had anything in this area other than my scout units. 
I wouldn't point. have had the time to build sensors yet. I just cluster my entire coastline with sensors. I cluster my coastline with bases. <laughs> Boreholes. That too. Which is why I never knew about the river thing. Because I would never notice if it was emptying into a borehole on a coastline. All right, I'm going to quickly save and reload repeatedly, just trying to get an idea as to if there are any nutrient resources or anything like that. There are not. So this is actually where it's going to end up. And I am going to insert a regular probe team into that queue because <clears throat> there is no way that base is not going to get probed just none it's not it's going to happen yeah unless if I build hunter seeker which I don't have the tech for right now hmm, that one's independent uh, so it's that one isn't it no oh no you're that, it isn't you're right um, so it's good that we ended the turn in fungus. Yep. Indigenous life forms. <laughs> Even more! Yeah. I am building a navy. Isles of the Deep now. Which is good. I like Isles of the Deep. Yeah. I love Isles of the Deep. Mm -hmm. And they I love the how best... they don't get our support if they're in fungus. Yes, they are the best sea in it. For a good chunk of the game. Complete. Yeah. That's in far. They... Yeah, it is. Which means Mars on the same continent as, well, no, maybe not. That could that's probably a sea base. Ah, that's interesting. Very. Which also means that this unit's probably gonna die. Probably, but. Enemy project initiated. Hi. Hi. Production. Somebody has started the maritime control center. That's not allowed. You started You're that? Done with it. Oh. Mar? Hmm. Shame. Request confirmation. Shame. <laughs> yes, own. Mm hmm. Goodbye. <laughs> Okay, what was I doing with this unit? I think I was just farming. Hi. You don't get to move into your zone of control anymore. Your cycle is providing. Um, not much of anything right now. It's just providing two minerals. Ah, uh, forest. Yeah. Yep. I just didn't have a better spot to put it at the moment. Mm. So, fun fact: in the original Civilization, if you canceled a unit's turn, it got back its. Um, action point, assuming it was doing something, which meant that you can actually click on a, a um, for Civ 1 it was a settler, tell it to do an action like build a farm, then cancel it, then build a farm, then cancel it, then build a farm, and it will build one in one turn. <laughs> that does not work in Smack, for reference. There. Now there's actual things nearby. And I'm pretty sure that this is where this is where I'm actually going to build that base. It's a little far apart for me, but it'll be fine. I can always fill in later on. 
I heard a kitty. Is that a probe chip? Yep. Yes, it that's is. A profile. The scout foil probe. Yep, but it's interlude time. Yep. Yes, they are here. All assembled in the room expected this news. Yet it sends a ripple of alteration through the room, as though you had announced the death of the entire Council of Overlords. Secretly, you and everyone else here had been hoping that the hated usurpers died upon planetary entry. Now, you know this is not the case. This changes nothing! Smoothly, you alter the entire hum of conversation to lend emphasis to your meaning. The plan goes forward as agreed, as we agreed. The usurpers must die, and we must continue our quest to contact the homeworld. That Manifold Six may remain pristine. Are we committed into the death of one or the other of us? Many on the council look uncomfortable, their eyes blinking rapidly. You can tell, understand their feelings. The caretaker cause is dedicated to peace and the status quo. This destructive posture is not in keeping with your stated goals. Finally, Kala Lamota interesting name, articulates what the others are obviously thinking. Can we not try once more to reach an accord with the usurper leader, Mar? In such a dire circumstance, even he may see the wisdom of cooperation. I'm sorry, my friends, you alter sharply, expressing your regret and displeasure at the same time. Think of the usurper cause. They wish to gain transcendence with Manifold Six. We know what happened at Tau Ceti when the flowering was allowed to occur. Destruction. Death. You see the fear on all faces, their mandibles drawn tight to their mouths. We all know this, including the usurper, Mar, you continue, and yet they continue on their quest for transcendence. We cannot understand this. They move inex uh, inexorably. How do you say that word? <laughs> inexorably? I inexorably. think. Inexorably. Yeah. Toward it's a death. Word. Yes, it is. And I mostly see it written out and not spoken. We have asked, begged, fought, and died to prevent this, and yet they still come. Surely a small thing such as this shipwreck will not alter their plan? No, my friends, we must be firm in our resolve. Death or freedom for Manifold Six? Do you agree? Your words are altered, one by one, by each of the member of the council. They all assent. So, you cannot Sorry, ever... Um... Well, yes. Uh, you cannot ever have peace with between progenitor no matter what you will always be at war it is impossible and as far as i know you can't even glitch the game to make it possible but um probe team so no they're going to die we are still at an informal truce because none of us have ever actually signed anything oh, damn it game no Unity foil or Unity rover, that is acceptable. Is it at least independent? No. No. <sighs> oh well. Indigenous life hmm. Caught yet another Isle of the Deep. Life okay, oh. this is the first time you're fighting one. And yes. that was the one that wasn't independent. That Correct, that which is why I'm not too concerned. Um, both of these are independent? Yep. Indigenous life form. <laughs> <laughs> You're capturing them. Well, I mean, I... Ooh, I also got the spore launcher with it. And they're nice. all independent. Nice. I have something to scout that continent with. And pick up pods. Uh-huh. All right, we have the Manifold. Manifold? Maritime Control Center. I'm seeing too many references to Manifold 6. Let's watch the pretty movie. Wait, did is this one that I didn't have last time? I don't remember now. You usually have it. True. It is altogether fitting that we who have sailed the deeps of space now return again to the sea. This is in many ways a water planet, and it can be ruled from the waves. 
With sea power, rugged terrain can be bypassed and enemy strongholds isolated. Once naval superiority is achieved, planet is ours for the taking. Colonel Corazon Santiago, Planet, a survivalist guide. What's really unfortunate is that it took them until Civ 5 before they finally got subs that can go underneath terrain that other units couldn't. And some Marines are useless in Smack. Yeah. I could hear vague sounds of Corazon's voice from that video coming from your microphone yep. picking it up. That's because I have Smack's volume reduced, but I don't have the Wonder Movies reduced. I actually have to go in, edit it, and mute my own audio. Which is annoying. Um, That's probably a good way of handling it. Yeah. Well, I don't even need to mute it. I just need to drop the volume by quite a bit. And it's helpful to learn things about video editing from these projects of ours. Mm -hmm. Oh, absolutely. Well, I consider a career in video editing because I don't particularly enjoy it. Yeah, I definitely don't. I sort of enjoy it, but I don't want to do that much editing compared to recording. Ugh. It's bad enough that editing these videos are now taking longer than recording them. Yeah. I mean, back when I was still using the uh, YouTube video editing, editing took less time than recording because I'd edit at um, point uh, or one point twenty five x or one point five x even, which like just reviewing and then just editing or cutting out the mining animations in Skyrim mm -hmm. <laughs> or obnoxiously long loading screens. I don't think that's a normal base name. It is. It is? Okay. Pretty sure it is. Okay. Well, editor me will figure that out. Because I've been looking... Yeah. Every time that there's a base name that I go, I don't know if I recognize this. I've actually been editing in what number it is on the list. I noticed. That's a useful tidal wave. Thank you. I mean, it put me in the middle of fungus, which is not the greatest, but this is actually the direction I was trying to go. Because I can do that. Or mine worm harvesting. Start reducing the power of that fungal tower. We are going to remove, discreetly remove some fungus. That's more than six tiles away, isn't it? Two, three, four, five. Yeah, that's seven tiles away. That's not going to work. <laughs> and that's also seven tiles away. I think you're just going to stay there for a turn. <sighs> Flat, arid, forest. Well, I can't take the mind worm, but I can at least neutralize it. You're going to mine because that's a mineral tile. stuck. Not oh. recovered. Eh. Not oh. recovered. Hey, look, it's a library nodule artifact. Yay. Nice. Unfortunately, I'm in enemy territory right now. 
Life no. Unacceptable. I don't want to lose that particular unit. Okay, you're not the one with the... Indigenous life forms. But recovered. Free network node. Okay. And I end up taking that Isle of the Deep anyway. Okay. <laughs> Are you also independent? Yes. Go forth, my independent armies. The only downside is I'm not getting money from them. All right. Where are you going to go? Actually, you're going to take care of that spot. There. Dancer. Uh, you're gonna move over to that corner briefly. Oh, um, one moment. I need to pause the recording because I just received an email I need to look at. Sorry about that. I just received an email approving my library card request. Hooray! Libraries are awesome. I almost feel guilty for not using my local library much anymore. Mm-hmm. Yep. It is a land base. That is a lot of military units. And that is really close to Data Decentral. How in the world are the Data Jacks alive? Because they have a philosophy of giving the enemy what they want. Ooh. Really wish that this was a probe team. But it isn't. So I'm actually going to retreat from the usurper area. Because... That only has laser weapons. That's not good enough. Speaking of. You can do missile now. Yep. I was just seeing what units I have that are. That will have to be. Uh. If I'm going to make a unit like that, I could just do that for the, um... For the prototyping? Prototyping, yeah. You're the independent one. I don't particularly want you to stay there forever. You're going to go this way. Turn complete. And my first pop, or second pop, first pop of this recording at the very least. Production complete. And I don't think fungal pops come up with an interlude for the progenitor. I don't remember now. Goodbye, probe team. If only you had the probe team there so you can figure yes. out if the usurpers and pirates are allies or enemies or informal mm -hmm. truce. I mean, I could hurry a skimship probe team. Mm. Request confirmation. I have enough for it. Just reinserting formers into the queue. I think it actually is worth hurrying that because that is going to be very useful information. Terraform complete. Yeah, knowing whether the pirates are a potential ally or if they're just waiting to stab you in the back. Uh, they're waiting to stab me in the back. They're, they're the pirates. That's what I mean, they yeah, do. they are, but... But if they are at war with Mar, then they probably don't want to be at war with you as well. True. One, two, three, four, five, six. If I survive the battle, 
buy enough of them marching there. Yep, which I did. Yep. Yay. You will level up that chopper sometime yet. <laughs> Some century. Okay. Bot recovered. I recovered a Unity foil with my destroyer transport. At okay, least game. it's independent. Yes. Otherwise, that would have been a reload. Unity foils are awful. Yeah, they are. Also, at least I have the um, maritime control center where they're still capable of moving. <laughs> yeah. Um, nope. uh, the unity set of units. Yep. They can't be yep. mass upgraded, can they? Nope. Nope. Because they're not in your prototypes. Correct. Or, yeah. And you also can't make a prototype of them. Right, so you can't take advantage of upgrading them all and still be able to move that round. Correct. Harmonic Acolyte. That's a standard. Yeah, it is. I haven't had any of the weird names. That's a little weird. Maybe they didn't make as many for the progenitor faction. That doesn't make much sense, but... Nom? No, nom. I actually have to fight. How dare I? I survived. That's all that matters. Get even more of them! <laughs> At this rate, I'm going to have the largest military. <laughs> that unit is uh, injured. Yes, it is. I should probably let it rest, but it's acting as a good yeah. scout right now. That's, uh, okay, that's Aki's base. Probably. Um, the border. Yeah, the that definitely looks border. like Aki's. Yeah. And that would make sense location wise. Um, one difference when you are a progenitor race is that you don't get the interlude about building your first mind worms. Mm. Yeah, I noticed that. Mm hmm. Oh, you built a mind worm in a base that doesn't have a biology lab. Yeah, I know. But I really needed something. Yeah, you should get that to an upgrade monolith because it is feeble. Yeah, it is. But then, well, actually, they're not that far away, I suppose. Mm -hmm. We'll have you at greater intertwining. How's research coming along? Uh, five more turns. Mm. Okay, you're actually independent. That means that you're useful. You're sleeping. Right. I need Centauri side before I can go directly to Happy Fun Times. Vendetta on Mar. And Pact Sibling with Rose. And Treaty with Domai. Interesting. Mission hmm. accomplished. Ha. Huh. Also, they have Missile. So they're actually in line with me on tech. Let's find out how close they are. So yeah, they are just less explore and discover than I am. 
and they're currently researching environmental econ, which is a terrible tech for them. Yeah. Okay. Not very useful for them. No. Um, we're going to talk to them really fast. So I'm going to revert from survival. So I have any chance of... Never mind. We're not talking to them. They hate us. <laughs> um, I was going to see if... Uh, Whatchamacallit, I can get the cum links from them. Four more turns, got it. Another library nodule artifact. This is the one downside of the jungle. It's really hard to tell what's rocky and what isn't. Yeah. Okay, that's flat. That's rolling, rolling, rolling. It's just the tile that I'm on that's rocky. Got it. Hmm. You should build a foil transport prototype just to upgrade the unit in foil. That's probably not a bad idea. Because then you would have two uh, two sites. Yeah. I mean, I actually and have... more movement. Yeah, I already have it because it's a default one. I just need to upgrade. I'll try to remember to do that next turn. Although I'm at an hour for recording. So but next turn would be the next video. Yep. From Unity Foil to regular yep. transport foil with no extras? I believe that's the case. I thought you had to put an ability or something on it to make it different. Oh, I think I had to, but I mean, now it's only I'm... It's only different in that it's slow. Yeah, it's not going to be able to tell me one way or the other right now. Yeah. I think the pirates are trying to invade Mar. Oh, that base placement is awful. <laughs> Problem means I kind of want to play for another hour. Well, we could just record another video. I'm not sure if I have the time. I have so many other things I should do today. I mean, yeah. I know the feeling. Can I defeat you? No, not like that. <laughs> Maybe get a spore launcher or two over there and bombard it for a few turns first. Yeah, I probably just need to not suck at luck. Free scout patrol. That's the one that needs to rest. But yeah, it's but it's not, not currently on fungus. fungus. Yeah. Also, it's finished its scouting. So I don't really need it to rest. To get it at full health so that you have a better chance of I mean, fighting yeah, against but... other Isles of the Deep. I suppose. Alright, so this is where we're going to stop this video for today. 
I hope you've enjoyed listening to the two of us talk while I'm playing Alpha Centauri. Um, I'll talk to you next time, Internet. Yeah, let's not wait as long to record the next one because yeah, that would know. be nice. Although next weekend's your birthday celebration, so yeah. Bye. Bye.